Hey, 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 peace and blessings, peace and blessings, peace and blessings. Rob YB Youngblood coming at you with session number 15 of the Confidence Builder series. A uh, series that is focused on empowering, inspiring, impacting you to live out your God-given purpose. Uh, and it's a part of the Collaboration Creates Currency movement, which will impact 100,000 lives in 2024. I'm your host, Rob YB Youngblood. Excited about being on this journey with you, this daily journey uh, that will continue for as long as I can put this content out, which I don't believe I'll have any short of content because I'm sharing excerpts of various books that are making an impact on my life and I'm praying that it will impact your life as well. Today's session is going to get into the meat and the heart of building confidence. We're now on chapter three of The Magic of Thinking Big by David Schwartz. Phenomenal, phenomenal book, which has impacted uh, over six million lives uh, worldwide. And uh, you can find the book at Resist Booksellers out of uh, Petersburg, uh, Virginia. Go to resistbooksellers.com. You can get that copy of The Magic of Thinking Big. You can also get a copy of my book, Collaboration Creates Currency. The Blueprint for Visibility, Credibility, and Profitability, which is a major part of the financial literacy movement. Uh, as a matter of fact, I created the Empower 5K Financial Literacy Initiative so as to impact 5,000 lives this month during Financial Literacy Month so that individuals can learn the most powerful aspects of financial literacy that comes even before you start talking about money. So in today's chapter, uh, which is entitled Build Confidence and Destroy Fear. Uh, Dr. Um, David Schwartz states, Friends mean well when they say, It's only your imagination. Don't worry, there's nothing to be afraid of. But you and I know, this kind of fear medicine never really works. Such soothing remarks may give us fear relief for a few minutes, or maybe even a few hours, but the it's only in your imagination treatment doesn't really build confidence and cure fear. Yes, fear is real, and we must recognize it exists before we can conquer it. Most fear today is psychological. Worry, tension, embarrassment, panic all stem from mismanaged negative imagination but simply knowing the breeding ground of fear doesn't cure fear if a physician discovers you have an infection in some part of your body he doesn't stop there he proceeds with treatment to cure the infection the old it's only in your mind treatment presumes fear doesn't really exist but it does. Fear is real. Fear is success enemy number one. Fear stops people from capitalizing on opportunity. Fear wears down physical vitality. Fear actually makes people sick. Causes organic difficulties, shortens lives. Fear closes your mouth when you want to speak. Fear, uncertainty, lack of confidence explains why we still have economic recessions. Fear explains why millions of people accomplish little and enjoy little. Truly, fear is a powerful force in one way or another. Fear prevents people from getting what they want from life. Fear of all kinds and sizes is a form of psychological infection. We can cure a mental infection the same way we cure a body infection with specific proven treatments. First though, as part of your pretreatment preparation, condition yourself with this fact, all confidence is acquired. Let me say that once again. All Confidence is acquired, developed. No one is born with confidence. 
those people you know who radiate confidence, who have conquered worry, who are at ease everywhere and all the time acquire their confidence, every bit of it. You can too. This chapter shows you how. So understand that fear is real, but like any disease, like any infection, it can be treated and it can be cured. And this is why I established the Confidence Builder series to break the cycle of poverty, mental poverty, emotional poverty, financial poverty. All of those stem from some form of fear or lack. And as we acquire confidence, as we acquire belief, as we build on those things to get experience, we put ourselves in a better position to grow and make a difference in the lives of others. This is session number 15 of the Confidence Builder series. I'm your host, Rob YB Youngblood. Join me every single day uh, between 7 and 8 a.m. in the morning, typically about 7.15. We come on here uh, to share some insights that will insight that will inspire, empower, and impact you to live out your God-given purpose. Make sure uh, you visit the Collaboration Creates Currency Movement.com to learn more about the movement. And should you have a desire to learn more about the book Collaboration Creates Currency, go to CollaborationCreatesCurrency.com. Looking forward to continuing to build with you. Feel free to share your comments, your feedback. Share this out. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. And until tomorrow, be encouraged, be blessed, but most of all, be faithful over the gift that you've been given. And remember, your gift will make room for you. We'll see you tomorrow on the Confidence Builder series. Peace.